With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is if the sum of first t terms of an AP is equal to the sum of first q terms, then find the sum of first p plus q terms. So firstly, we will see the formula of sum of n terms of AP that is equal to n by 2 into 2a plus n minus 1 into d. So now we are given that sum of p terms is equal to sum of q terms. So if we substitute the value of n to be p, this will be p by 2 into 2a plus n minus 1. Sorry, n here is p. So this will be p minus 1 into d which is equal to q by 2 into now we see that this is the terms of the same series therefore their a and d will be equal so this is equal to 2a plus q minus 1 into d 2 and 2 will get cancelled so if we multiply this will become 2ap plus p square minus p into d is equal to 2aq plus q, a, q square minus q into D. Now, if we bring all the terms on one side, this will become 2ap minus 2aq plus p square minus p into d minus q square minus q into d is equal to 0. From here, if we take 2a to be common, we will get p minus q plus this will, if from here, if we take d to be common, we will get p square minus q square minus p plus q is equal to 0. Now we have our identity of a minus b into a plus b which is equal to a square minus b square. So we see that we can apply this here. So this will be equal to 2a into p minus q plus d into this will be p plus q into p minus q and if we take minus to be common we will get p minus q and this is equal to 0. Now from the whole term if we take p minus q to be common we will be left with 2a plus d into p plus q minus 1 and this is equal to 0. So from here we will get the value of 2a plus p plus q minus 1 into d to be equal to 0. Because we know that if p minus q is equal to 0 then p will be equal to q which is not possible because they are different terms. Therefore, 2a plus p plus q minus 1 into d is equal to 0. So, now we see that we have to find the sum of p plus q terms. So, we can put the value of n to be p plus q. So, sum of p plus q terms will be equal to 1 by 2 into n which is p plus q into 2a plus here our n is p plus q minus 1 into d. Now we see that the value of 2a plus p plus q minus 1 into d is equal to 0 from this. So this will be equal to 1 by 2 into p plus q and into 0. Therefore the value of sum of p plus q will be equal to 0. So this is our required answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.